Hi everyone and welcome back to the Big Buds. If you love minifigures, don't forget to check out our Minifigure Monday playlist. And whilst you're there, maybe subscribe to our channel. This week's minifigure is from series 13 and it's the Fencer. Now, Ian reckoned this was quite a basic minifigure, not all that exciting. But I, there's a couple of things that I'd like to discuss about him that seem a bit wrong to me. So I posed him there exactly how he is on the um, little leaflet that comes in the minifigures. So I don't know if you notice that he's got one white hand and one yellow hand. So he's obviously wearing a glove on the one. And I looked this up because I'm not an expert on fencing, but I was intrigued. Um, and some people say that you can wear both um, gloves on both hands. But they say that you should wear at least one glove on the hand you're using. <laughs> so why he's got his epe in the ungloved hand i do not know so i'm going to move it over because i think it's wrong here we go fixed it so there you go lego i fixed that for you um i quite like the detailing on this that the fences normally have quite a long um outfit so you can see that it's got the detailing on the the legs to make that torso seem longer um, so it sort of continues down which I like um, the fencing logo on his top a little bit bland um, I think if you're part of a fencing club you might have something more exciting than just two swords but you know who knows what's under his face mask um, or fencing helmet whatever you call it um, you could put any head under here so I'm going to check out and see if he's got an interesting head or not and if he does I'm going to swap it for one of those old style heads that aren't all that exciting because you know what's the point of having it under under there I think if he's going to go in my city we're going to need two of them because why would you be wandering around the city without uh, or in these clothes um, without being at a, an actual event a fencing event so I think you can't you can't have one um, maybe or maybe he's training but I don't really know how he trained for that so let's have a look under his helmet oh hello um, so that's an interesting face isn't it I don't know why he'd be making that face he did one eyebrow down maybe he's really concentrating maybe he's proper trying to stab the other guy is that how you do it in fencing I don't know I'm not an expert on fencing I did do fencing actually um, at university, I've, no, I didn't do fencing. I did I do fencing? I at least went to a fencing club. <laughs> it's it's a long time ago. It's hard to remember, but I'm pretty sure I went to a fencing club. I think maybe my friend was doing the fencing, but maybe I tried it out. I can't remember. I'm I'm not sure, but yeah, I, I'm clearly not an expert, even if I did go. Um, so. <laughs> I digressed a little, I apologise. Let's have a look and see if he's got any detailing at the back. No, all pretty white. I did read that um, the gloves that they wear these days um, are now, instead of just being leather, are made of a, a more washable material, but don't put it in with your white outfit because the colours will run. So that's a little bit of fencing um, hints and tips for you if you need it. <laughs> so yeah, I'm definitely going to... Um, I think I've already got a, another fencer, so I'll definitely include two in the city somewhere, having a, a bit of a battle. But I'm going to use that face somewhere else because I think that that's quite a good one for using in a scene where something's happening that they're not overly happy about, maybe. Um, or maybe, it, mm -hmm. yeah, it's a, it's an odd odd look to to hide away. Um, so, what do you think of the fencer? Where are you going to include him in your city? Are you going to have more than one? Let me know in the comments below and don't forget to like and subscribe so you never miss an update. See you later.